welcome back for another GU question of the day. Our question today says, the nurse is caring for a client who had a transurethral resection of the prostate or a TERP eight hours ago and is receiving continuous bladder irrigation. The, ner the urine in the drainage bag is dark red and viscous. Which of the following actions would be a priority for the nurse to take? So we are looking for an action that the nurse should do first, um, something that is highest priority, right? Um, so option one says to document the findings. Um, this is an incorrect option. It's not the priority here. Um, we do want to make sure we are adequately documenting intake and output um, for a client who's receiving uh, bladder irrigation, but it is not the priority action in this case. Uh, option two says to increase the irrigation flow rate. Uh, this is going to be our correct option. So the goal with continuous bladder irrigation is to prevent a urinary obstruction, okay? So we have that catheter in place, we're putting fluid in constantly and pulling it out to prevent clot formation and then bladder obstruction, okay? So we want our urine to be a light pink color. Um, that indicates that like clots aren't forming, everything's flowing well, um, light pink is the goal. So when we have dark red, we are not putting in enough fluid, we might have clots developing, so we wanna increase the irrigation flow rate put more fluid in to help kind of, um, you know, irrigate and wash away any clots that could be forming. Uh, option three says to remove the indwelling urinary catheter. Uh, this is an incorrect option. It's something we don't want to do. It's not even a priority, right? It's just not something we want to do here. Um, we need that catheter in place, like we said, to be able to irrigate to prevent that for the clot formation, okay? Um, and then option four says to use sterile water to manually irrigate the indwelling urinary catheter. Um, this is not a correct option for this item and for this circumstance. Okay, so when we have, um, you know, the dark red blood, we definitely want to increase our flow rate. If we have no output, we are seeing nothing in the urinary drainage bag, we likely have developed a clot and we have that obstruction so we can't get any flow out of the bladder. So with this, we want to manually irrigate, um, irrigate the catheter to help dislodge any clots. So I know that's kind of a lot um, to, to think about, but we just remember here that like light pink is the goal and we are trying to prevent bladder obstruction.